The gifts that I have received are absolutely amazing. Um, I wanna first start off with the frames here. These frames are hand wrapped, okay? And you're able to customize them. So I have the cancer symbol here, and then I have my moon and rising sign here. And again, these are hand wrapped, and I have the emblem here um, where the third eye is, and it is filled with Argonite. Um, when I tell you, like, they take their time to give you custom pieces that they have meditated over that they have poured so much love and understanding over and i'm so grateful to have uh found these two individuals um so that i can manifest the f out of my life all 2024 and like i said this is just one of the gifts that i received from them of course you can tell that i'm super proud of them they are super cute and i just love them uh super excited to have them <laughs> and then um i received a bracelet oh my goodness when i tell you i've had this bracelet on since i received it this is the cancer symbol again we have the cotton candy crystals here um we have the rose quartz um and if you're not sure what rose quartz is good for go ahead and look that up um it's such an amazing um crystal to have and then we have the cancer emblem the eye of horus if you don't know what this is look it up okay get an understanding of this do your research and then we have the argonite heart here which has a lot of healing properties in that as well and when i tell you i was super excited to receive my gifts from manifestation nation and this isn't this isn't all that they give you, okay? Because on top of them encouraging you and um, holding you accountable and helping you to manifest your life, they have the most amazing energy. Like, you can tell that they are genuine, they are loving, they are supportive. They, they really do have great spirits. And I'm so glad to be a part of their community and it's so many great people in the group it's so many people in the community that are amazing people and amazing amazing spirits on them and i'm just happy to be a part of the community and i look forward to meeting some of you all there um so go ahead and head over to facebook look up manifestation nation and join our community um i promise you you will not regret it all right, so now that I have um, spoken my piece about Manifestation Nation, um, again, I will not be before you long uh, because it has been a struggle trying to get this video uploaded. And um, but we're not gonna let the we're not gonna let the opposition win, okay? Um, but the message here today is: even if you're not feeling your best, even if you have people that you thought you could trust and thought that loved you and thought that you know you thought that they wanted to see you do your greatest even if those people um kind of turn on you during this journey um stay the course because on the opposite side of fear and rejection is love and acceptance Stay in a constant state of gratitude, no matter how hard it may seem. Understand that your purpose is greater. Your life is greater. Your love is greater. And you matter on this planet. You matter in this universe. And understand that God handpicked and chose you for this specific mission. It may not look how you want it to look. It may not feel how you want it to feel right away, but keep going. Remain disciplined. Remain consistent in your efforts and in your goals and watch them come into fruition just like that. I am here to tell you today has been a rough day trying to upload this video. And I was not always um, together mentally to upload the video, but I decided instead of coming before you and um, pouring out the energy of uncertainty, I wanted to come before you and let you know that 
anything is possible as long as you believe in yourself. And even when you're in your isolation period during this journey, you're going to have an isolation period. Even when you're in your isolation period, please understand that so many great things are coming to you if you just stay the course and do not give up. Understand that there's going to be forces that come against you and they're going to come against you with familiar faces. They're going to come against you um, from people that you know and love and that you've never thought that you would have to worry about any kind of opposition from them. This is a journey of not only self-discovery, but of awareness and forgiveness. And on the opposite side of feeling unworthy and feeling like you didn't give your best and feeling like, uh, you know, what you have to offer is not good enough. On the other side of that is fulfillment. 